full-time RV hitch mount bike rack. I've seen videos of this particular bike rack that folks with e-bikes are using to install. I also picked up an anti-rattle hitch tightener along with one of these hitch locks. All right, let's get to it. It was a fairly easy process. It wasn't so hard. It was just that I needed to look at the instructions a little bit carefully just to make sure that those parts in the instructions actually match up with the actual hardware. The procedure, or basically just installing, it wasn't very complicated and it wasn't very hard. You know, I was sweating more because it's kind of hot outside. Uh, in terms of uh, challenges or snags, the only thing that was a snag when installing the trailer hitch lock. Now this is a trailer hitch lock that I picked up at Amazon. And the only downside of that full-time RV trailer uh, bike rack is that they, there's not a locking mechanism to hook it up to the, t to the trailer hitch. And I bought one of these things to make sure that it locks onto uh, to the hitch. So let's say if I uh, take the bike out and I'm riding around in the park, my bike rack will be secure because of this. But the only downside is this did not fit in the hole itself. <laughs> So this actually fit, but this part was a little too, uh, was a little too big. So I'm gonna have to return it. Now I just have to make sure that I can find a hitch lock that will fit. Overall, it was a success. I'm gonna test fit the e-bike onto my rack. <laughs> I'm gonna test fit the e-bike onto the bike rack and then just go around the block to check for noises or any rattles and things like that. And I'll take some footage of the run. All right, that's all for now. If you like these videos, please subscribe. Give me a like. Talk to you later. Ow. Fing. All right, it looks pretty stable. I think this will be good. Just came back from testing out the bike rack. I actually mounted uh, my e-bike on the bike rack and just wanted to see the my work quality and the, the bike rack didn't fall apart. I took it out for like a good 15, 20 minute ride just to see how it holds up and held up pretty well. I actually reinforced the mounting points with some bungee cord so that doesn't shake around so much. Primarily, there are these two little racks where the fat tires would rest along with a hook above the, the bike rack. I wrapped some bungee cord around that so that doesn't move around so much. And it held up pretty well. So thank you all for watching. Like, comment, or subscribe. Remember, it's never too late to be a better version of yourself. I'll talk to y'all later.